It's time to talk about microdermabrasion and I've been so looking forward to chatting to you about this one because it is truly one of the most amazing products we have. Okay, let's revisit the skin. We have our three layers and today we're focusing on the top layer which is the epidermis. Now, In that top layer, new skin cells are formed and then they take the 28-day journey to reach the surface of our skin. Now, when those cells are born, they're plump, firm, happy skin cells. They kind of like resemble grapes, lovely, firm, plump and juicy. As they travel, they lose their structure and they lose their moisture. And let's say they look like raisins. And when they reach the surface of your skin, they've now lived their life cycle and they're now dead skin cells, which is what we see on the surface of our skin. Now, these dead skin cells, or we'll talk about them as cornflakes today, can be up to 15 layers deep. And they can create both a protective barrier, of course, which is essential to us being alive, but they can also create a detrimental barrier in some ways. So let me explain. Now, here is a picture of us and our beautiful skin. Now, you obviously know that that is a picture of me. I just took that of myself in my bathroom this morning. Just thought I'd let you know that. And this is the KJ version of what these cornflakes or dead skin cells look like on the surface of our skin. Okay, now because there's up to 15 layers or multi-layers, there are some points that are higher and some points that are lower. And it's this multi-layering that can cause micro shadows on your skin, sort of like little umbrellas on some points. And these little umbrellas cast micro shadows. So the more layers, the more micro shadowing. And this can cause your skin to look dull and lifeless, so to speak. No radiance, no glow, no good. But wait, there's more. Let's take a look at the paint picture. Now the picture on the top is another way to look at the cornflakes on our skin. So you'll see it's dry, it's flaky, it has different colouring, different texture. We want our skin to look like the bottom picture, smooth, clear, bright. Okay, so what do we need to do to make that happen? We have to kind of like renovate. So we're going to talk about that again in a minute. Let's go back to the cornflakes. What else can they do? Okay, pigmentation, which is the UV rays coming into our skin, causing the melanocytes to create melanin, and this creates spots. So we have older spots appearing on the surface of our skin, so that older version of pigmentation, and that can hide in some of those layers of the dead skin cells as well. Oh, too many things. All right, what else can it do? The more cornflakes you have, the more of a chance you have of getting blackheads. Not a lot of people like these. Blackheads are simply the pores of your skin blocking with a plug of a mixture of those dead skin cells and the oil that comes out as well. Now, this plug then gets hard, blocks the opening, oxidizes, so becomes black, therefore blackheads. Okay, what else? Excess cornflakes can also hide precancerous cells that can lurk in some of those layers. Not to mention the havoc of trying to keep your makeup on. So imagine trying to apply your foundation or your blush or your eyeshadow, let's say, to that picture of the flaky paint. So you put this new colour on and what happens is that unstable paint underneath starts to flake off. This is exactly what happens with your fake tan as well. So as those skin cells start to fall off, so does the colour of the tan or the colour of the makeup that you've already applied and it never stays on as long as you want it to. Also, I know, there's more. The more layers of cornflakes you have, the harder it is to topically apply fabulous and essential products such as moisture, antioxidants and you know my favourite, of course, the SPF. I'm not saying that it doesn't get absorbed with these layers of cornflakes. It's just not as 100% of effective. And if I'm going to use amazing products like Restore with peptides and antioxidants or I want to use retinol or C10, I want them to work at 100%. So I want to know that they're being absorbed 100%. So here it is, microdermabrasion. This is an exfoliation. It's a mechanical 
version of exfoliation and it helps to get rid of some of those 15 layers of dead skin cells or the cornflakes that are on the layers of your skin and it leaves more beautiful radiant skin showing through underneath we're getting rid of some of those umbrellas and the more beautiful skin underneath that shows and the less umbrellas we have the more luminous bright and alive your skin will appear also, the removal of some of these cornflakes also tells your body to start producing more of its own lovely plump new skin cells, all those grapes that we saw in the picture before. And the more new plump skin cells that are being produced, the brighter, firmer and younger your skin will appear. All right, we're getting some good ticks so far. Also, when we get rid of some of those cornflakes, we're addressing some of those leftover layers of the pigmentation that is there and also those precancerous cells. So exfoliating with microdermabrasion addresses some pigmentation and precancerous cells as well as when we resurface those very top layers, the microdermabrasion can lessen the appearance of lines and wrinkles by removing microfine layering, making the actual depth of the line or wrinkle appear even less. I'll tell you, it's getting all the ticks. Okay, let's go to makeup and fake tan. When we put those beautiful colors, and of course with Nutrimedics, natural, wonderful colors on top of our skin, we have now already removed some of those unstable dead skin cells, so your makeup's going to last so much longer. Your tan is going to last so much longer. I can tell you, I put my makeup on at 6.30 in the morning, and apart from a quick touch-up with some powder at lunchtime, when I get home at 11 o'clock, it is still amazing. And to think of the years, I'm sorry, before Nutrimedics, that I used to spend on this so-called long-lasting makeup that was chock-a-block full of nasty things that we don't use at Nutrimedics. And even then it didn't really stay on anyway. All we have to do is go back to nature and go back to what we offer and use these simple steps and you are going to be looking fabulous for hours, let me tell you. Getting rid of the layers of cornflakes will also help you topically apply all of those beautiful things like our moisture, our antioxidants and our SPF. And once we do that, we know they're going to last 100%. So we've got three exfoliators. We've got the complexion refiner and the facial peel cream. We've already talked about those in other gold mails. Go back and have a look at them because they're both super unique products in their own right. But for microdermabrasion, it's an amazing exfoliator that's designed to gently yet super effectively buff away some of those 15 layers of dead skin cells using microfine quartz crystals. And we use those instead of common plastics or aluminium oxides as they're much more gentle on our skin and they won't cause any unnecessary trauma. So they buff away some of those layers, leaving that beautiful bright skin to come through. It also has shea butter in it, which is beautiful, comes from the oil from a nut from a tree in Africa, and it's got beautiful beneficial fats that promote cell regeneration. There we have it, more grapes, and helps circulation. And it's full of vitamin A and E, which we know are two of the most powerful antioxidants. Oh, it's a superb moisturizer. Also has biosaccharide gum that is found to soothe and moisturize the skin. It's also a water binding agent and it forms a barrier on the skin's surface to prevent future water loss. Makes the skin beautiful, soft and smooth. Okay, the rehydrator or step two has lavender flower extract. We know lavender um, has been used for centuries as a natural antiseptic. It's also a calming, soothing agent as long as, as well as sea buckthorn oil and of course the most important taking away some of those barriers or layers we need to protect it with the SPF 25 to ensure that we don't get any future damage because we've now got rid of some of those mm, nasties that were kind of protecting it in a bit of a way in the first place. So for the price of one treatment at a beauty salon you have got 12 to 15 treatments of our beautiful microdermabrasion. Don't forget always work on the back of the hand with any of your guests at parties or a one-on-one -on -one demonstration so they can see it and feel how amazing it is. And once they see it and feel it, you will have a client for life. Well, there you have it. 
microdermabrasion, one of our most amazing products. And I know when you know it and love it, you'll tell the world about it because it's truly one of our most unique products. Thank you so much for listening. And until next time, it's KJ signing off. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.